Prince Philip's favorite royal family member. There was a strong bond from the get-go. Prince Philip formed a strong relationship with one particular royal during the Queen's reign despite their adverse feelings towards the royal family's public life. Prince Philip, 99, we were really strong relationship with his youngest son, Prince Edward, since birth, according to the royal biographer Richard K. In the Channel 5 documentary titled Edward and Sophie, The Reluctant Royals, he explained where Edward was a favorite of the Duke of Edinburgh who was present for his birth. Edward, 56, has tried to stay out of the spotlight due to wanting to give the children a private upbringing. Journalist Aisha Harzari said, I think it's fair to say that he was very the baby of the family. He really was the apple of the queen's eye. Narrator Glynn's Berber say, Prince Philip also built a strong relationship with his youngest son. Mr. K added, Edward was the particular favorite of his father, the Duke of Edinburgh. There was a strong bond between the father and son right from the get-go. Royal expert Ingrid Stewart say, He was the first of the four children that Prince Philip was actually there at the bedside during the birth. The world had moved on and he was more of a modern father. Miss Barber added, treated differently to his older siblings. Edward became a sensitive child, but when the time came for him to start school, he was forced on to the same strict royal path as his brothers. The documentary also highlighted the vicious labels Edward received after the U-turn in his career. The youngest of the Queen's children had followed his, in his elder brother's footsteps when he joined the military shortly after leaving Cambridge University with his BA in History in 1986. His plans were to join the Royal Marines, but he dropped out after only a third of the training and was mocked by the press. Former Royal Press Secretary Dickie Abitur said, the newspapers were up in arms. They called him all sort of things. They call him a weakling, they call him a coward, it was pretty nasty. Miss Berber added, he just felt like he was going along on a railway line and suddenly the rails weren't there anymore. Prince Edward was a crossroad. He needed to find a role for himself and was naturally drawn back to the theatre, the only thing he really loved.